This is the Onkyo CP1046F. I don't particularly care for the uh, model numbers that they used. It makes it sound like a fax machine or something, but this particular unit is pretty cool. It works really well. I got it all restored, meaning it's got new uh, phono lube on the gears and all the mechanisms, cleaned up everything, got the um, stylus functioning properly. Anyway, you can see, I already put a 33 on here, uh, just so you can see how it works. Basically, I'm going to turn it on. This light is not to be confused with a stroboscope. This is actually the indicator that shows when the quartz lock mechanism is, at, is uh, correct at the right speed. Right now it's on red, which is indicating power. Right now we're going to do the automatic feature by simply pressing start. Tone arm cues up and lowers down. You'll notice the brush, which has actually got some stuff on it already. <laughs> Sounds pretty good. Cue it. That's queued up. You can also search, which is interesting. I'm going to go in one direction, you press it again. The other direction. You line it up with the, the white line on the uh, for the guide. So I'm going right about there, maybe. It's probably off. Yeah, it's way off. Well, anyway. Do you have an idea what you can do there? I was playing a 33, 30 centimeter. This is where you set the size, size or speed. Then you have the repeat option, which works really well. I'll show the repeat option in action. What I'll do is I'll cue it to the end. Nice and smooth. It's got a two pound uh, aluminum platter. And of course, this has uh, the manual op operation as well. Wait for it to cue down. I'll go ahead and stop the. Uh, there we go. So if you don't want to use the automatics, you can just take the finger lift, wait for the light to turn green so you know you got your proper speed, and then set it down. Let it rip. That's not the original uh, 45 adapter, if anyone's wondering. You can watch the other video, and you'll see it playing a 45. And the dust cover, you can actually see the little circles better on the on here. Those little circles. It's like someone had something set on, sitting on top, maybe. Can't get them out. If someone wanted to really go out and buff them, you probably can do it with maybe a drill and a power buffer. But that's the Onkyo CP1046F. Playing a 33.